Muslim women living in the West are always in the spotlight. There's this really, you know, like ugly narrative that's just kind of been force fed to us about Muslim women in particular. You know, that we were all black, we don't talk, like, we're oppressed, we don't talk, we're all Arab. We're mocked, stereotyped, and pitied. Daily rights for women. women, what about, what that about? That is completely separate from us and any convention. We seek refuge in our communities. We're told that God has given us rights, given us opportunities unimaginable to most women until very recently. So why is it that many of us are unable to access our God-given Islamic rights? Disappointed, many of us turn to feminism. There is space for every person here to be unabashedly exactly who they are in whatever shape or form that takes. We're told that feminism stands for equality. We're told that feminists fight for women's rights. That's what we're told. But is it true? The real question of QDs is, can we as women truly choose who we want to be beyond the world models that are imposed upon us by society? So why shouldn't Muslim women support feminism? Ask yourself, why do you feel estranged by Islam's treatment of women? Are you naively using feminism as a band-aid? Not realising that there is more to it than meets the eye. Discover the Islamic alternative to feminism. Visit thinkingmuslim.com